guys welcome back to my channel so I wanted to film something fall related since it is the beginning of fall and it's my one of my favorite seasons fall and winter like this time of the year from September until December my favorite time of the year I just love the fall and winter I love the holiday season I'm just super excited so I wanted to film something fall related and I thought I would do a little Bath and Body Works candle haul I know a lot of people don't buy Bath and Body Works candles, or I feel like a lot of my friends don't at least, but to me, they have some of the best fall and winter scents. Like if you want a very large variety and some of the best smelling candles, I think you should go to Bath and Body Works. And they're not that expensive. Bath and Body Works frequently has sales. It's I purchased a few of these, or I purchased all of these candles except for one during their buy one, get one free sale which I don't know how often they do that or if they have that sale often enough. I know they usually do buy one, get one half off. So I just took advantage of the buy one, get one free. I didn't buy that many candles, but I also would only live in a one bedroom apartment. It doesn't take a lot of candles to make this entire place smell really nice. So yeah, do people still wear their, um, their hair in these half up buns? I don't know, I just, I was just feeling it today. So the first candle I got, I didn't get during that sale. I was just happened to be at the mall and I noticed that they had a Bath and Body Works store that was connected to a white, a white barn candle store, which I have never seen a white barn, is that what they're called? Yeah, white barn candle store. I've never seen that before. I don't know how many of them there are in the US. I feel like there's probably not that many. At the time, I think I went in July sometime, they already had a ton of fall candles out. Just purchased one of them. And this one was in the little mix and it is the Cinnamon Sugared Donut. I think I've only ever purchased this one other time in the past because it is more of a bakery scent and I don't usually go for that, but I love the smell of this. This smells so nice. It's a bakery scent that doesn't lean so sweet which I find that a lot, of, a lot of their other baked good things, like they're just so, so sweet to me and it gives me a headache. And this one borders on spicy because of the cinnamon. It says here the notes are crushed cinnamon, sugar crystals, and homemade donut. So I didn't buy that candle during the buy one, get one free sale. The rest of these I did get during that and I bought doubles of two cents. The first one is sweater weather. I just really, really like this scent. It's one of my favorites. I will say that Bath & Body Works changes their packaging every season. So every year you're going to see a new packaged version of your candle scents that return. And I really like it this year. Um, I think it's really, I don't wanna say plain, but it's really simple and I like that. It's not so busy, I guess. I love the font that they used on these. The only thing is, I'm confused as to why they chose a light blue as the colored wax here. Um, I was expecting something in the regular fall colors of red, burgundy, golds, oranges, dark greens, browns, or even like a darker blue. I don't know. It was just something that I thought of. But I do really like this scent. The notes here are fresh sage, juniper berry, aromatic, eucalyptus, and fresh woods. And I feel like compared to previous years, this has a stronger eucalyptus scent to it. Uh, it smells really clean and fresh, which I like. And the next candle I got is Autumn. Autumn is definitely a little bit of a more fruity scent. It smells a lot like apples when um, you burn it or when you smell it, I haven't burned it yet, obviously. So when you smell it, it does smell a lot like apples, but not as strong as their regular apple scents. The notes here are bright red, gala apple, juicy fig, eucalyptus leaf, and fir balsam. I don't smell any of that fir balsam, which to me is more of a wintry smell. I don't smell that here. It definitely just smells like apples plus eucalyptus, which that's funny that eucalyptus was in both of these candles. Interesting. So the last two candles I have are actually more of a cologne smelling candle. 
it has that more of like cologne scent to it so it's a little bit manlier i guess and it's not so fruity or sweet and i prefer those scents the most in any candle i just i don't know why but i prefer that in perfume i prefer that in candles it's just what i like and the first one is crisp morning air so to me this not only smells like like a cologne but it has that woodsy and fresh scent to it i can't explain it but there's no scent of lemon in this whatsoever the notes are crisp fall breeze which i don't even really know what that means <laughs> white oak, golden amber wood, saffron, and soft sandalwood. But to me, this just smells very woodsy and lemony. I don't know why that is, but that's what I think of. It's a nice, like, musk wood, sandalwood scent. And I am saving this one for when it gets a lot colder than what it is right now. So like I said, I didn't buy any mahogany teakwood candles i actually don't think i saw any new packaging of that one out i really hope they didn't do away with that one because that one is just my favorite but this one is a close it's definitely probably like in my top five favorite candle scents or at least fall scents from them and it is flannel so this is definitely my favorite packaging out of all the fall candles that i have or at least that i've seen so far and i just really love the font here I love the image that they use on the label. I love, love, love the color of the wax. Anything burgundy in the fall, I'm all about that. I just love it so much during this time of year. I don't know why, but it's probably like, if I had to pick a favorite fall color or color to wear right now, probably burgundies. I just love them. And to me, this, just like Mahogany Teakwood, is a candle that you could bottle up this scent and I would probably wear it as a perfume every single day. I love it that much. The notes here are crisp autumn air, which along with that crisp, what was it? With that crisp fall breeze, I don't, I don't know what they're trying to say with that or what that's supposed to smell like. So it's crisp autumn air, bergamot, heirloom mahogany, and soft musk. This one definitely has that musky, like not a bad musky smell to it. I... I, don't, I just love this candle so, so much. So that's it, guys. That is the video for today. It's not a very long video. I didn't go crazy on the candles this time. And yeah. So I hope you like this video. And I will see you next Thursday with a new one. Bye, guys.